the monarch is having a few different other situations going on where they have to travel 2,500 miles up to 3,000 miles when they're going back and forth from Mexico to Missouri or Mexico to Wisconsin. Butterflies leave Mexico in March and April and fly to the southern U.S. to lay eggs. The new adults disperse throughout eastern North America for the summer. Information suggests that three to four generations of butterflies occur per year. Male and female monarchs are flying through our area right now. They're just getting here in higher numbers and they're feeding on our nectaring plants. But then also the habitat that contains the milkweed is disappearing as well as our nectaring plants because of mowing and because of herbicide use. So all of these flags over here on our right indicate milkweed species that have been planted. The plants in the genus Asclepius, all of the milkweed species, are specifically what the monarch babies have to eat. So the adults lay eggs on the plants, the larvae must feed on the milkweed plant, that's why it's a primary component of the habitat. So when it gets to this time of year, the females are looking for milkweed. There's probably going to be a limited amount of milkweed and what happens is that multiple eggs get put onto one plant. This supposedly didn't happen years ago because we had so many milkweed around. The female was able to only lay one or two eggs, but this year we have observed maybe seven to nine uh, eggs put on per plant. For the next month, the monarch will be here. She will be laying eggs. The middle of September thereabouts, they will have a, a change in their biology which will cause all the new adults to migrate back to Mexico.